it does have the effort. Okay. <laughs> what? You have to explain my research, right? I have to explain his. Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> Two atoms go into some shape of um, tunnel. We see a cut through the wire and it looks like a donut. So what kind of cable could transmit something that looks like a wave? A fiber cable? Yes. The shape here is because this fiber has a hollow core uh, and the atoms would go through that fiber. We ionize them, then we trap them. That allows to make quantum computation. Oh, wow. What I see is a DNA molecule produce a protein. Yes. So I guess you want to understand the behavior or maybe the link between the DNA and the function of the protein. You let an AI try to figure it out. <laughs> wow, that's a very good uh, way to put it. I'm a bioinformatician. I wrote code to understand this relationship between molecular machines and their function. My work now has turned into something where I want to use have AI become an agent that takes my job. There is a link between our two jobs. There is this hope with quantum computers to simulate the motion of protein. That is actually such a hard <laughs> problem that maybe even AI needs years before it can answer it.